Right, ladies, I'm back. Now, I went into a shop uh, we have here um, called Wilkinson's, and it's rel relatively cheap. You get some really good bargains in there. And um, I picked up... Oh, it's Wilco's, should I say. I picked up uh, some metallic paint in gold, uh, and in this one you get in 125 mil. But it's a nice soft gold, that. I also picked up a silver. That's all it is. And it's just called co uh, Colour Time. Another glue stick. Always have sparing. Um, I managed to get some self-adhesive labels to label all my uh, boxes that I've got to finish. Um, I bought myself a couple of these. And these are the, um, you know, the a little punch. I needed one for school, but I'll, I need one for my craft room as well. Just a little punch. Just a thin one. But it does the job. And um, so I got a pink and then I got a purple. Yeah. So one for home, one for school. I managed to get some more of these, which are the index uh, card refills for doing the stamping on. And, you know, you can use them as tags or whatever you want to do with those. And I got these pens. Now, the reason why I bought these, the fine liner pen. Now, I'm not sure how many people do this or know about it. When you're um, doing your art things, and if you happen to paint a picture and you want to do um, outline something, these fine uh, liner pens are ideal for it. Uh, they're really fine. And um, I'll show you what I mean. I'll do a, a tutorial on them. See, really, really fine, but um, I don't know if you can see that, really fine. But that, the black and the ideal for outlining something to make it stand out of the page. So I was, I was running out, so I've got a couple more of those. Binder clips, bought these, tubs will come in handy besides anything else. Um, it's all taped up in it, silly old. Let's have a look. Gorgeous little fancy clips. So they're mainly only to go into swaps and that, so I'll just pop a couple of those in with all the other bits that I put in, but um, they come in handy. So I managed to get those, I bought them in the plain colours, metallic colours, oh, I bought two of those. Quite nice little clips they are. I then bought this, which is a 3 by 5 by 5 um, picture frame that I saw, and if you look at that, Painted white, it's quite heavy. Um, I think it's made from plaster and it's really, really pretty. And I thought on the front of a journal, look, ornate, isn't that ornate? And I thought on a journal that will look stunning. Either done in the gold, you know, this, uh, like I did the clock, I'm not which I've not finished yet, um, or just painted. I might paint it and just put a couple of flowers on it or something, I don't know. But I do like that. Thought that'll look nice to do up. So there's that. I mean, it was only two pounds something, so you can't go wrong at that price. Um, oh, I got this for putting the. I've got some die cuts for Catsy that I'm going to pop in there. Just a little folder um, that I've got, to, like I say, for Catsy A5 folder, so that they keep protect them in case they. Uh, I don't know because I, I the bags the the busting open the bloody envelopes and that they, these days. Um, have a look, see what's in them. And you don't know what you're going to lose. I don't want to lose any of the bits that go with that. Again, I bought two of these. I do keep a stock in, a, cu a couple of them in. And these ones are quite easy to use. So, a couple of those. Um, again, two extra fine line pens. For different uh, different detailing. Managed to pick up some of these. The 24 resealable bags. The clear ones. So, uh, I've got a few of those. One, two, three. I've got some more here, I think. Yeah. Because they're different sizes I don't have. And then for a pound, I managed to find five five sheets of A4 pastel vellum papers. And they're the colours. So you got five in for a pound. Um, and they're nice colours. Nice for doing the butterflies and that. And then I happen to find these. You get eight sheets of ivory linen card lovely lovely card for craft work 
so you can't really see it but it's ivory and it's really really pretty really nice like the old-fashioned vanilla ice cream look so I got two of those eight sheets and they get a pound so that wasn't bad now I've also bought um, it um, from the pound this was from oh no it was Wilco's but it was a pound and it's the uh, 75 by 75 centimeter play mat and it's a washable play mat but the reason why I bought it is because I'm sick of these getting a mess you know what's under my thing so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pop this under there to protect this washable mat <clears throat> So I, then I don't go because I go through an awful lot of this chipboard. Um, I also bought five of I think it's five yeah five of these, three D embellishments. So we've got that one. Somebody who plays darts. Um, <clears throat> butterfly ones. Lovely little teddy bear ones. Look at those. <laughs> Pretty little things. Party ones with the parcels in. And then a lighthouse one with a ship. So just while they had them, thought I might as well get them. And then again, thinking outside the box. Now, you get two in each pack. And what they are, a draw your own jigsaw puzzle. Now, I was thinking about these crafting, you know, these journals everybody's doing. And um, these would be ideal um, to stamp your own image on it, colour it in, or whatever you want to do, and then you could take so many pieces off and put into your art pages. And you get two for a pound, or with a 50p. I think these were 50 pence, actually. I think they were. Or a pound, don't matter, anyway. So I've got four of those all together. And uh, I just think they'll be a good idea, really good idea, to add to my journal pages when I've stamped and coloured them in. Why not? Something different. So, there you go, basically. That. Oh, no, wait a minute, no, wait a minute. Here we go. Now, I managed to find these. See them? And I didn't get them for the plastic bits, although that won't go to waste. But I got them for this. I'm not sure if you can see that really really soft fibers um and for, for doing my floral sprays and these were 97 pence for three you get three bunches for 97 so i bought two sets but to put in the floral display the uh, di displays they'd be ideal really really pretty uh, and look nice and it's called saffron red grass so i got two of those two sets and then just some really big vanilla envelopes. Oh, and I got some bubble wrap as well. Uh, like I said, I've got all these parcels to do up and get them out. So I'm going to be doing that for the next couple of nights as well. So that's it for me, ladies. I enjoyed that. <laughs> Always look out for a bag, and why not? Do like that mesh. I thought that was brilliant. And like I say, I managed to pick up my uh, canvas boards for a pound a piece. And what I'm going to do is every month is get so many canvases. Because when I do get my uh, room, um, I'm going to be doing my own artwork in it. Uh, hanging it up on my wall. So that I'm surrounded by what I do. Why not? So, there you go, ladies. That's it for today. I'll speak to you soon. Thanks, everybody. Bye.